I don't even think it's a crime. I don't go out there thinking I'm gonna get busted. I love it so much, I'm willing to take that risk. Right now, this is Queens, one of my favorite spots under the highway. People have been painting this spot for years, way before me. It was just on the low. I found my own way to get in, and then started telling my friends, and then once that happened, you know how that go. My first mentor was Edge. He put me on and gave me a lot of my style. It's evolved like most things do. I'm still a street walker, a street bomber, you know, but at the same time, I've always liked to do artistic work. Catching certain spots or walking the streets, you know, there's nothing like that. I've been painting since 79. It kind of evolved from just liking to draw in general and then just wanting to put that in the street, just tagging my name, you know? And then you just wanted to do something bigger and better. You know, there was times where you want to do a spot, especially when you're bombing solo, you're trying to get out of there real quick. So I was like, all right, let me come up with an ill T. This was the first T. This is like maybe 81. It was just kind of like leaning to the side. And then I started making it skinnier, but it was still leaning. Then it was a period of time where I started to do like this, where I had like a space in the middle. And then I added the other side. And then I started making it like this, like on some points. To me, it's just expressing myself. It just happens to be called graph. I love the notion of a guy wearing a mask and he was right in front of you, you didn't know who he was. When I paint things in the street, I want it to last. I don't really like doing things that are gonna get buffed or this. I'm catching spots that are gonna be here forever. As you grow, you start to get better and do different things. And right now, I'm trying to get into more of the artistic side of it, but at the same time, you know, stay with my roots. Now we're on our way to that Barry abandoned station. It's cool to just do this whole shit right here. We're gonna do two on each side. You know what I mean? Do some big shit. All right, so basically we're gonna knock out these fills. Let that dry real quick. Get as many colors and blend it in there as possible, you know what I'm saying? People think I just like bombing, but you know what I'm saying? I really appreciate good art. Mixing colors, you know, blending pieces, practicing letters, I've always liked that. You can fill a lot quicker with two hands. With two colors, you can just, you know what I'm saying? Most of the color schemes I come up with are just by accident. I can basically blend anything, though. It's like, you can give me any colors and I'll make them look good together. It's all in how you use them. Now we about to rock the outline. A little drop shadow, bomb. I love when toys and all these other people get busted. Like, they didn't do what they were supposed to do. You know, they don't have their mindset right when they're doing something. So please, keep getting those niggas. You know, if it offends you, don't look at it and move. You know, if, if not, embrace it, because it's not going nowhere.